the droids are finally getting the love they deserve because in the next update this month on august 28th they're getting their very own skins something we've been asking for for a long time now and that's what we're taking a look at in this video today plus we've got the very first footage of naboo four player co-op in the new pve mode which will be arriving in september alongside the new clone commandos instant action mode and of course the new planet felucia which looks absolutely gorgeous from the concept art we've seen so far and a huge shout out and big thank you to river thames for providing this footage from gamescom be sure to check out his channel by clicking on the link in the description below he's got some really cool stuff that you gotta check out so there will be five selectable droid skins that you'll be able to use for each of the classes including assault heavy officer and specialist and these skins include the new pilot skin jungle skin training skin and then of course we have the default skin that you'll be able to choose and the geonosis skin as well now i'm going to read over the descriptions of each one of these skins as we take a look at them and then we're going to jump to the new uh, naboo four player co-op uh, action here in just a second but let's take a look at the pilot skin he looks so cool here i'm going to read off the description from the community transmission which says this it says bridge crews serving aboard the separatist flagships consist primarily of battle droids responsible for managing the fleet's autonomous capital ships and starfighters and personally for me i think this one's gonna be my favorite it's got that cool blue color and uh you know if i was a droid i'd want to be a pilot droid or someone helping out you know the pilots on the uh, separatist flagships how cool would that be now we're going to move on to the jungle uh skin right here and the community transmission had this to say about the jungle skin it said when fighting in jungles and dense forest environments some tacticians apply camouflage to their detachments of battle droids in order to minimize the chances of detection and you know what i think this is going to be most useful of course on kashik because of course kashik is a jungle map and it's going to give you that edge when facing off against camouflaged clone troopers now let's talk about the training droid and the community transmission had this to say about the training droid it said inside the secret cloning facilities on a camino cadets spar against training droids in simulated battle scenario so a really cool backstory for the training droid skin i do think this one's going to be a really popular droid skin and i think a lot of people are going to be using the skin especially when facing off against clones on camino and finally don't forget you'll still be able to choose the default and geonosis droid skins uh, that's a brand new thing as well because of course we've never seen the geonosis skin on other planets besides geonosis so that's going to be really cool and now we're going to take a look at the brand new naboo four player co-op pve action right here this is from the droids perspective they are the attackers so here we go enjoy the ride and i'll see you guys in the next video